Hi guys, it's me again. Um, I just wanted to do a tag video because I thought it was pretty cool. So uh, I came across a weight loss tag video and um, Rocky Baragan, I think that's how you say it. I'm not sure, but she uh, created this tag video. Uh, she started it. So I'm just going to answer 20 questions. It's pertaining to weight loss. Um, I didn't look at all of them, so if I take a while to answer, it's because I'm trying to think, but um, let's just see how it goes. So, first question is, when did you start gaining weight? <sighs> Let me start by saying that I never um, was a small girl, you know, I always a little chubby little thing. Um, I lost weight, actually, I'm going to start from when I lost weight. I lost weight when I was in the 8th grade. And um, that was the slimmest I've ever been. So I would say I started gaining somewhere in between my senior year of high school and freshman year of college. So I'm going to say freshman year of college because, you know, they say the freshman 15 or for me it was the freshman, I think, 30 or 40. So um, I went down south for school. So everybody knows southern food is just irresistible so that's where I reached over 200 at so um and I haven't been under 200 since 11th grade so I'll say college um second question what was the heaviest you have ever weighed well considering well while being pregnant that was the heaviest I've ever been which is 267 um non-pregnancy uh which I guess that counts <laughs> that's the one that, that you want to know about um before I lost these seven point whatever pounds on Weight Watchers, so 245, I guess you can say. 245.2 is the highest I've ever been. How many diets have you tried in the past? And name a few of them. Well, I've tried um, Weight Watchers, the three day diet. Uh, um, Weight Watchers, three day diet. Even though I don't consider Weight Watchers as a diet, but lifestyle change. But, um,. You know, I guess I have it. I did the seven-day diet, uh, Atkins, um, low carb, uh, and cabbage soup diet. Yeah, so six, <sighs> and all of them were unsuccessful except for the three-day diet. Three-day diet, I actually lost eight pounds. So I was supposed to lose up to ten in three days, but I lost eight. And it came right back as soon as I stopped doing it. So, and plus, it was, I was killing myself. I was starving. So, yeah, never again. Weight Watchers, if anything, is the best. Um, what diet or plan have you current? Are you currently following? Well, if you're watching my videos, you'll know that I'm doing Weight Watchers uh, Points Plus program. Uh, the next question is, what is your goal? Is it a size? A number on the scale what is it my goal is to be in the healthy um, weight range um, for I guess according to facts and everything like that I guess that's somewhere between 130 and 140 for me um, but I'm not trying to get there like my goal is to be 160 because I like to be a little thick you know 160 165 so that's, that's my goal but, you know, I would love to be in that healthy range, but um, I think I look really, really, really slim, and I don't want to look like that. So, 165. Um, as far as the size, I would say a size 10. Size 10, um, some 12s, but mostly 10s, because I was a size 12, and then that goes into 14s, and then 14s with 16s, and now I'm almost in the 18, I'm between 16 and 18, and I don't want to do that, so I'd rather be in the 10, but can fit some 12s, very few, I want them to be a little loose on me, um, oh yeah, and I love double digits, I can't go below that, <laughs> what was your favorite food to eat before you started this journey, my favorite food to eat before this journey and during this journey is chicken and broccoli from the Chinese store, I swear, I love it. I can eat it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay? Chicken and broccoli with garlic sauce. White rice, though. Pork fried rice? Mm, not so much. But white rice, definitely. And it's healthy. It's only three points per cup for chicken and broccoli. And I believe it's five points for white rice per cup. So, yeah. That's my fave. Um, 
What is your favorite food now? Just told you. What is the only, what is the one food you will not give up? Chicken and broccoli. <laughs> I don't have to. Um, but if, if I can think of another one. Hmm. I like mac and cheese. I like baked mac and cheese. Um, yeah, I love baked mac and cheese. Okay, let me get back on untagged. I was about to go to the store and go get some noodles and make some. Um, <laughs> what? Oh, how do you reward your weight loss or fitness accomplishments? Um, I feel like it's very important to set small goals for yourself and always have an incentive when you reach those goals. Um, me personally, when I reach a certain goal, I say every 10 pounds, I'll buy me something new. Uh, whether it be shoes, whether it be pants or shirt, some type of article of clothing. Um, I'm a shoe fanatic, bags too, so I like to reward myself with, you know, little things like that just to make me feel better. Um, and I feel like if you're not doing that, maybe you should do it because people always look at the long-term goal as if, oh, I want to be this amount of weight, and you're not rewarding yourself for the little steps that you're taking to get there. So I think that's key, but um, that's, that's what I do. The last question is, what are you going to do once you reach your ultimate goal? I am going to find the highest mountain, okay? Stand on top of it and scream. I'm on top of the world, okay, <laughs> because you guys just don't understand how many attempts I've made, and I've said, okay, I'm serious this time, and how many times I've tried to lose weight, and I don't lose it, or if I lose some, and I quit, like, I don't want to do it no more, and I'm not going to do it anymore, like, I'm going to reach this goal, whether it takes me six months, nine months, 12 months, it shouldn't take no more than 12 months, <laughs> but I'm going to do it, I have to do it. So, when I get, hit that goal, yeah, I'm not going to really go on the mountain because I'm scared of heights, but I'm going to really, like, reward myself, maybe with a nice red velvet cake, maybe a slice, maybe not a whole cake, but, <laughs> yeah, it's like, just, I don't even know, maybe a trip, maybe a, a vacation, like, that's a good question because I need to plan this. You know, as I get closer and closer, I'm going to do something very, very special for myself because this is, the, well, that would be the one time that I was successful in reaching my long-term goal. Like, I've set goals before, like I said, and I've get halfway there, or almost there, but not there. So once I reach my goal, it's a wrap. But, um... That's it. That was the weight loss tag questions. Um, I would love to hear you guys' stories, so please, please, please um, respond to these questions and do your own little tag video, because I'm very curious to know about you guys and what made you start this journey, if you haven't told me already. All right, later.